Hello everyone, how are you year five? First of all, I want to tell you how much I missed you. I missed seeing you all in school and I want you all to stay safe at home. Okay, so today we're going to have a new lesson. I want you all please to grab your books and start. If your ICT textbook, open up page 3637. I want you to take an overview. 3637 is a start for your chapter, new chapter, handling data. My snack shop. My snack shop is the data that we need to handle in this unit. Okay? So read it, just for your information. After you finish reading it, go start with the first lesson, recording your costs. Recording your costs. Okay. After you read this lesson, we're going to start doing our work. For a start, let's review some stuff that we learned last year. So you're going to enter values into a spreadsheet. Values. What are values? Remember, values are numbers. That's easy. What are labels? Labels are text. Any text that you enter is called label. Labels, you cannot put a label with a value. Okay? For example, if you want to put numbers, you cannot add labels to it. If you want to put... Um, I'm going to show you the example today anyway, so just don't panic. Okay. Um, currency. How to format values into currency. This is the aim of our lesson. You're going to format values into currency. So read page 38 until 41 carefully. It's not much. It's very easy. Just do it. It takes only five minutes. Stop the video, read, and then continue. Okay, now after you finish reading your uh, text, please don't forget to download the file attached in your system in the extra resources and answer the questions. Uh, the questions, you've got hints for it to answer it, and I've said lots of things in the video you can make use of it. Okay, after you finish, the last question is asking you to type the uh, the table in page 40. This is the table. I typed it without adding or editing. I forgot the cost, obviously. So let's add the cost quickly. As you can see, I'm adding only numbers. I cannot add anything else. So remember, adding only numbers, values, nothing else. How do we adjust the width to make it? I'm going to leave it like this because I want to show you how to format your, um, your table. How to format it? You're going to use the home ribbon in the font section. It's called the text formatting tools. You're going to format your text. So click on the cells you need to change, bold and bigger. Okay, all these cells are bold. And the rest are regular. How do we make it fit? You have to go to the side of the column to change the width of the column. Double click or click and drag in order to change it. I double click and I can click and drag to change it. Yes, no problem. Also here, double click. Also here, double click. Done. Now, follow your book in order to do the cost currency. First of all, you have to highlight the cells you need to change or to add the currency to. So I'm going to highlight the values. I'm not highlighting this. Labels, no. Nope. So now I can go up here, click on this sign. You choose the currency you need. Once you chose it, it will change automatically. It's still a value. It's still a value. If you type the numbers and add um, uh, the sign of the currency using shift and a number here, like you can see, 
in your keyboard. You can see the currencies in your keyboard, right? It's symbols. You cannot do that, fine? You have to add it from here, from the number section in the home ribbon, okay? I hope it's clear. I hope it's easy. I want you to practice this. You've got two weeks to do that, and I hope you enjoy it. Stay safe at home. Bye. Please like this video.